Now, I haven't actually technically done this yet. So uh, I decided the last YouTube live stream I did, it was about a year ago. I think we had like a couple hundred people and I was drinking and installing Debian and it was a big disaster and it took like five hours or something. So to honor that memory of that terrible live stream, we're gonna install vanilla Debian first. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and close this out. Uh, we're gonna pop over on the desktop and get going with this. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be great. And we're on what you guys have seen in every video for pretty much the past year. I mean, I don't think, have I even changed anything in the past year? I think I've been rocking awesome window manager forever just because I love it so much. And I probably will continue, but this is a viable alternative that I think everyone can pretty much use. So let's go ahead and start our installation. I'll take a little questions here uh, once the installation goes off because we're gonna have a little bit of a wait. Um, I'm gonna be using boxes for this. We're gonna use that as the front end, QEMU is the back end. If we run into problem with boxes, we'll switch over to Vert Manager, but I think we'll be fine here. All right, here we go. Let's see what we get. Uh, install, install Debian. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that installation failed. Ah, you stay classy. All right, we're... <laughs> Oh, I love it. All right, we're gonna just go ahead. We're not gonna use uh, this machine for virtualization. That's all right, guys. We've got a backup plan. We're gonna use Proxmox. This is not on the same machine. It might be a little slower. Maybe it's faster. I don't know. Let's see what we got here. You know, if this doesn't work, I might just say, hey, this is my first back time back on YouTube. I'm just gonna wipe my whole system back to Debian. Uh, as far as disks, we have a lot of disks. I don't even remember what all I have on here. Um, let's do a sudo blkid. It's looking like we might actually need to just wipe this out and start from scratch, guys. Oh, I didn't want to do that on the stream, but we may not have a choice. All right, so let's first see if we need to actually wipe out the studio PC. <laughs> because it is not pulling in my ISOs on Proxmox. Oh, man. If you're not familiar with Proxmox, it's a way to virtualize and uh, get that going. Write it down before you reboot. I don't write anything down before I reboot and reload a system. I like to just shoot from the hip. It's where all the entertainment is. All right, uh, coming back into here. Let's see. It looks like it's not authenticating to this ISO. Uh, so what's happening right now is I'm trying to grab this ISO store that I've set up and it's not reading anything from that ISO store. So forget it. We're going to wipe out the whole system. I've been rocking this system for a while now, a whole month. Let's load it. Let's just do it live. All right. Let's make an ISO on bare metal. Who cares? Uh, this one's going to be SDF. And if we do an LS from our downloads, you'll see I already have some stuff in my downloads. Where's Debian? All right, so we're gonna do a disk destroyer, IF for input file. And the input file is gonna be downloads, Debian live, and with tab autocomplete. Output file will be uh, equal to dev and SDF. And we're going to do a block size equal to one megabyte and status equals progress to see where we're at. So this is the sample disk destroyer. It helps if you do that as sudo, which, you know, me, sometimes I'm not exactly sudo inclined. This right here is awesome window manager. And we're about to wipe the whole thing out uh, again. Oh, all this hard work on the studio PC of the past month will be lost because I didn't properly test my VMs prior to. All right, let's load this up. Uh, don't, don't you do this to me, Debian. Not again. 
I love you. Don't do this. Trying to do two things at once. It's going to end in disaster. I guarantee you, I'm going to wipe out this machine and lose all of my data backups and games. I, I know I'm going to do it. Uh, all right, let me let me hit display. Where are you at display? Absolute concentration right now on manual partitioning. Oh, Lord. Mm, I'm going to get ill. Uh, I hate doing it. I hate doing manual, but we're going to do manual. Because I don't think very many people actually do manual, but we're, we're going to do it anyways. Ah, crap. Where's EFI in here? All right. I got to admit, Debian, you suck. Oh, I hate you. I hate you so much. Like, it's just terrible. Oh, don't use Debian the first time around, kids. Oh, Lord. Which one am I going to choose here? All right. I think that should... Those flags should get us there. Hmm. Man. That is crazy. All right. And then we're going to do EXT4. We're going to do a root mount on this guy. We don't need any crazy flags. All right. That's our manual partition. Shouldn't really mess up anything. But then again, this has already been such a rough go on our first returning YouTube stream. All right, here we go. There's no turning back now. We have officially wiped out the studio PC live. So this is going to be either magic or tragic. Oh, crap. You know what I should have done? Darn it. Hmm. Can I cancel this? You know what? I'm going to cancel. Yeah. All right. Probably shouldn't have canceled that right on the installing thing, but... I, I want to do this. I'm sorry, guys. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta do this again. <laughs> uh, because it was just gonna, it'd be such a headache if I let this go through. We're gonna cancel right in the middle of an install. Don't ever do that. But I'm gonna do it anyways. All right. So we're gonna do that. But here's what I wanted to do, and this is why I I came back into here. All right. SDB one is home. So this one, here's why I I did that. We're gonna go home. Do not format this, please. All right. I, I forgot my home folder, man. Oh, that was gonna be terrible. Now it is going and uh, doing all the stuff we, hopefully we need it to do. Oh no. <laughs> oh, come on. Although I have been hammering away at Debian, there has not been a dull moment in the stream where I haven't been actively breaking this PC and installing Debian Linux. I don't know why every live stream where I install vanilla Debian, it just ends in disaster, but I have a good feeling about this one. I think it's gonna go well. No, no, Debian, Debian, come on, bro. What? That's not, that's not real. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> I'm never installing Debian on a live stream again. No. All right, we're rebooting. I don't believe that failed. I just don't believe that failed. No. No. No, that did not happen. One more time. Ah. Oh. That's just terrible. That's embarrassing and terrible, and I love every minute of this live stream. Oh, God. Don't use vanilla Debian, kids. <laughs> oh. Should have stayed with Mint. Yeah. Yeah. But the whole, whole, okay, so the whole purpose of this stream was to show something new. Little did you know. Little did you know. This is where we were going with it. <laughs> me me installing vanilla Debian incorrectly. <laughs> EXT4. Do not format. <laughs> Please don't format my home partition. Please, I don't want to lose all my stuff. All right. Right. It's going to work this time. I got a good feeling. All right. I think this one's going to work. Again, I don't know why I don't remember this from the last install. How long have we been live streaming, by the way? It doesn't feel like, but maybe 30 minutes. 
Oh God, an hour, 15 minutes. I'm, I'm totally becoming a meme right now. I feel like Linus does when he drops an electronic. <laughs> this is this is my this is my dropping everything that I touch. Installing Debian, disaster every time. All right, we're gonna use states. Uh, let's see here. Usually, I like to use LeaseWeb. LeaseWeb, I always get really good results whenever I'm doing stuff through LeaseWeb. Yeah, but yeah, Mira was had it was on the money. Non-graphical Debian installer for the win. We got a lot of hard drive activity over there, so we're fine. We're fine. This is gonna work fantastic. I can tell already. It's 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 good. It's just good. It's fantastic. 